Welcome back to another video. Today we want to show you how to make an inside and outside corner on a crown mold profile from the Nasser multi-profile cutter machine. So if you watched the previous video on the two-step, same thing here, cut, straight cut on the right side, just a straight cut, left side gets the flaps. So we're gonna do that for you right now. Put your hanger in, make sure you press it up against the back of the saw, 45. flat fenders, give it a little bend on the top, and that's your 45 degree cut. And now I'll take my measurement, like if you were on the job site, you take your measurement, take your line, take the square as well, straight edge, scribe your line, turn it to the 45 the other way, make sure you put your hangers in, for the appropriate spacing and then cut half an inch or longer past the line so you got your extra material to make your flaps. So now we take your calipers, measure the back again like this so you got the appropriate measurement for the line and scribe it, exact same thing on the front of the gutter. Just like that. Now you have your line to make your cuts. So because this is a crown mold and it has more curvature, uh, you need to make a few more cuts than the two-step if you've seen in the previous video. So what you need to do, on the bottom, go straight up to the line, cut off that section, and then make your flaps. Usually on the first curve, I have about four flaps. And you cut diagonally up to the small one. Cut that one off. This one I bend over because I, and I leave it a little bit bigger because that's where I put a small screw in from the other side. Take your flat benders, go on the line here, bend it back nice and so it's about 90 degrees. And then flip all these flaps over. Make sure that you give it a little tap so it goes straight up to the line. got your corner fits together just like that. That was the outside corner. Now we want to show you how to do an inside corner on a Nasser Multipro Gutter Machine Crown Mold Gutter. So same thing, you can make your cut here. On the inside, this, the left side cut gets no flaps. It's the right gutter that comes on this way, that's the one that gets the flap, so this one you just cut straight off. And then you turn it to zero degrees and then just do a little skim on the back so the back of the gutter is nice and square. So same thing like all the other corners, Make sure you take your straight edge, make your line.
and then make your cut half an inch longer. So then you take your snips again, cut the inside, and then take the flap renders and make your flap go inside of it, crimp the top here, and that's your inside corner. So now you install this piece of gutter on the house and then this one just slides in just like that. Well, that closes this video. Thanks so much for watching on how to make an inside and outside corner on a crown mold profile. Make sure to comment down below if you have any questions or contact New Tech Machinery and they'll get back to you with all the questions you have. Thank you.